So my name is Leticia Anamale and I work at the Intercultural Association of Greater Victoria, which is an immigrant welcome center um, in town. Yeah. So this project is about... So um, how this project came about um, was uh, a couple of us who work with youth in the community were contacted by the Heart and Hands Health Collective um, to come and create a mural for this space. Um, and so what we decided to do um, is to work collaboratively for three months um, and to bring together three youth groups um, and to work on a project uh, that primarily focused on violence prevention um, and doing it through the arts. And so what we've been doing is we've been mentoring youth um, uh, using theater, using body mapping, using different visual arts techniques um, to explore um, like really tough issues like violence and colonialism and uh, and how to build community and how to build vibrant community um, uh, because we know uh, this neighborhood uh, you know there's sometimes some stigma around um, who lives here and it being a low-income neighborhood especially and um, we all live in this neighborhood and we all want to um, make it uh, accessible and we want youth to feel that they have a place here and feel welcome and so uh, we decided to um, turn this into this project um, and uh, yeah and it's been going really well so far. So the organizations involved in this project um, are Antidote, uh, which is a multiracial and indigenous girls and women's network in town, um, Project Respect, uh, which is a youth-led uh, project out of the Women's Sexual Assault Center, um, and they do a lot of violence prevention work and education um, in the community, and then the Intercultural Association's Youth Program, uh, which serves newcomer immigrant refugee youth. Um, so these uh, three distinct uh, groups of youth came together to, to do this project together. of black. Only five. So we're going to have to take turns. Okay. And I'm going to do a little bit on the bear so everyone can get an idea. The, um, and you can have a, this, you can have a little fun with the black. Like you can do things like the very end because we only have five cans and we have to help we really have we have to outline everything that's there first before we get to that. How you doing? Doing good. It's got a little bit more to go.
Um, hi, I'm Cameron Kidd. I'm here today facilitating a mural workshop, a community-based uh, arts project in downtown Victoria. We're painting on the side of uh, Hearts and Hands Health Collective. Uh, they've uh, provided the wall for the project to be done. Uh, the youth are all organized through the Intercultural Association, um, Project Respect, and Anti Antidote Youth Groups. We've had about 15 to 20 participants today, young, old, everyone that's come down. So it's been a pretty fun day. You can see that um, it's been pretty colorful and uh, everyone's learning how to use spray paint. A lot of people have been uh, trying it out for their first time. So. Um, it's been it's been pretty exciting to see what's what's come of it. Um, the imagery that's on the wall is drawn up by the youth over the last couple weeks in previous workshops, and we've translated it into larger scale uh, murals and let them do the work and kind of guide them along the way. It's been a good day, and yeah, thanks a lot.